Hey guys, Mike here at Amish Tutorials and welcome back to a new video. Okay, well today we're going to do an animation video, all right? Um, in front of you, you see a runway with a kind of uh, mock-up uh, aircraft or spacecraft, whatever you want to call it. It's uh, very simple, very basic, but that's not the point of this video. And what we're going to do is we're going to animate this guy taking off from the runway and going up and banking to the left, okay? All right, so how are we going to do that? What we're going to do is we are going to attach our aircraft to an animation path, all right? So we have our spacecraft and we are going to create a path first, all right? So we're going to switch to our top view like so, and I'm in wireframe mode, as you can see, five for shaded, four for wireframe mode. And we're going to go in and we're going to go to uh, create and let's see, curve tools, CV curve tool. Okay, so we're going to start in line with our, uh, let's just call it spacecraft, why not? Okay, and we're going to start to click and make a straight path over our runway. And it's not exactly straight, but it is what it is, okay? And then we're gonna switch views and we're gonna start to go up. And let's make this kind of funky, okay? With some weird movement in there, that's fine, okay? So we're gonna hit enter. Now, as you can see, this is fairly flat. It's on the ground, okay? So what we're gonna do next, while we have that selected, is we're gonna hit E, and we're gonna rotate that upwards. Okay? So now you can see that the spacecraft will move up and bank, okay? And also, we're gonna bank it up like that. Now you can see that your path line is now below the runway. So we're gonna hit W, and we're gonna bring that up until it's close to our spacecraft there, okay? Now this is maybe a bit steep, so let's just uh, bring that down a notch and bring it down like so, okay? All right, so this is the path that our um, spacecraft is gonna take, okay? Now, if you're not happy with the path because it's not smooth enough, you can go in you can right click, go to control vertex, and you can take individual points and kind of tweak them, okay? Just to make the ride a bit smoother, if you will. All right, okay. So now that we got that, we're gonna um, uh, attach a number of frames to our animation. And I'm gonna go with the 2000. And the reason being that I want this to go fairly slow so we can see what's happening, okay? So 2000, we're gonna select our spacecraft. We're gonna shift select our path, like so. We're gonna go to our animation tab and we're gonna go to constrain, motion path and attach to motion path, all right? So now, if we play our animation, we should see our spacecraft take off and follow the path. All right, here we go. And there you have it, okay? Now, we're not quite there yet, because normally when a, an aircraft or a spacecraft uh, turns in a corner like that, it would bank to the left, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit play and we're gonna stop about there. Now that's a point where typically the craft should bank. I'll go back a little bit, probably around here, and just scroll your animation line, okay? And then we're gonna go into our motion uh, path one in our attribute editor. Just hit Control A to pull that up. And here you have the option, if you scroll down, to select bank, okay? now. We want the bank to be um, to the left, okay? So let's change this value and let's uh, zoom in on our guy here <clears throat> so we can kind of see it better. 
Okay, so let's do three. You can see that it's banking to the left just a little bit. I'll do a bit higher numbers. You can see it better. Eight. So now you can clearly see that our craft is banking. Okay, if you want it to be the other way, you do a negative value. Okay, so let's do eight. All right, so we're going to scroll back on our animation line here. And let's kind of zoom in and see if this works out for us. Okay, and we're going to hit play. It's taken off, it's going up, and it's banking. Had a little glitch right down here, so we can kind of smooth out that path. It's not the, uh, the best path. Uh, I did it a bit quick, but you can play with that. Okay, so that's all there's to it. Um, easy peasy. Okay, now um, you can do a lot of stuff with this, so uh, be creative and come up with your uh, own application for this. And uh, that's pretty much it. So if you've got any questions, uh, let me know. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.